Good evening, everybody. This is Subject 84. This is part 5. Let's play Uncharted 3. Drake's Deception. Last time I left off, well, we just finished up um, the Underground London chapter, and and now we're in uh, freaking... How you pronounce that word? That C word. Shantou? The Shantou? And so, the reason why we're here is because we're looking for uh, T.E. Lawrence Treasure. So... As you see my last bit, we can't we can't go in the front door, but don't but so our only option is we gotta climb up climb outside a wall, then do a leap of faith. Oh fuck, come on, I made that shit before. Don't don't bullshit me, game. And that's a nice way to start start out this episode. Let me see, is it gonna affect that cutscene again? Yeah, it does. I hate to say it, but I think this is an LP curse because I never died there unless it's, unless I, I think I have died when I first. Oh, I see what I did. I didn't walk on the fucking board, did I? All right, come on, you can make it. Yes. I didn't walk on that fucking uh, that board thing. That's why I died. Yeah, so fuck that. So that's my second death of the game. <laughs> okay. Okay, we could go in there, but just for the hell of it, we're going to take the top route. Even though it's going to take you to the same uh, direction. But, in case you guys 100% this, if you go into the top window, you should see a, you should see a, a treasure chest. I mean, a... Oh, shit, I don't think I... Well... It's no point showing on now because I already collected. it. But yeah, if you, t if you take the, uh, the, the, the top window, there's a treasure you can collect. So we walk down there and down we fell on the ground. And that's smarts too. Alright, so obviously you want to take out your gun to shoot that lock off. <laughs> Alright, shoot that thing down. Alright, then so he's gonna take you to that door on the on the right or left, his left, and try to open it, but you can't because that fucking thing is in the way. But we still gotta have, we still gotta let the cutscene uh, prevail because they don't let they're not gonna let a sequence break. Yeah. Right. See, you could just run straight to the freaking, uh, the, the, that freaking door, but the game's not gonna let you until you try to open that door on the left. This will work. So what is up, everyone? So today is, uh, September the 11th, 2013, and yup, you heard me right. Today's been 12 years since, um, uh, that 9-11 went down. So, like I said in my previous videos, be sure to to pray to your friends and family. Because that was a really sad, tragic 12 years ago. How can I forget that? Because I won't. No one's not going to forget that day. Oh, God, I thought I was going to die again. Like a total dumbass. Alright, now you want to keep tapping triangle to um, raise up the other chandelier. But yeah, but I still remember when when um, me and my mom was in the bedroom and we seen that we seen the two buildings explode and we see people jumping out the window and my god that was so freaking depressing and we did see people jump out the window and that and that really tore us down so anyway now you want to get to the top and um, move that beam and keep tapping triangle. But don't worry, this ain't bad as that uh, microwave part on Mother Gear Solid 4. Let's just drop down. Alright. Yeah, it's a popcorn machine. Okay, let's see if we can find a way to that tower. Alright. Now I'm on my practice file. I got a little loss here, but because I keep forgetting where I had to go. But this chapter right here is pretty interesting. So 
so you want to drop down here you should see some stairs alright you want to go up the stairs then the cutscene should activate wow I just love how it slowly just appear out of nowhere Nice. This is where the game will, will try to trick. You may think you can go up the second floor, but what you really want to do is you want to jump out the window. Alright, let's see what's up ahead. Okay, I think I already clicked that treasure there. Alright, now you want to jump through here. And wait for darkness. Alright, now this should be your freaking, um... A thick wall you should squeeze into. Yeah, this one right here. Looks like we can get through here. Yeah. Yep. Okay, good. Uh, Nate does it for us, so we don't have to tap a uh, triangle or anything like that. Okay, I already know about this puzzle. So here's what we got to do. You want to turn this knight with the shield to the right. God damn it! Have this knight with the shield face the guy with the axe. You gotta have them face each other. Alright. Then you want to turn this knight to the middle. And, and with that, we get the secret passage with the dark smoke coming out of there. We got a secret passage! I'll push you pull. On three, ready? Wait. One, two, pull. Or one, two, three, pull. Just pull. <laughs> Yo, mommy, your closer for comes a bit. Oh shit, we going underground. Do no 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 no. 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 Do no 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 all right. So we gotta do is gotta navigate. All right, where is who? Oh shit! Now you gotta squeeze through that fucking wall. Oh my god! If fucking Cutter was here, he would have a fucking heart attack. I want to tap a triangle. Ah, spiders! Me hate spiders. If my sister were here, she'd have a fucking heart attack. Oh my goodness, my practice fire actually died here because the swing fish sucks. Alright, come on. Oh my god, I hate I hate making Nate swim in this one because the control is so fucking awkward. Alright, come on, come on, come on. Uh, keep hitting circle. Oh shit. Just keep going straight. But don't be on the water too long, because otherwise you drown and die. Alright. Come on, get out the water, Nate! Oh my god, get out the water! Here we go. But today, now we hear that dun 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 music from uh, Sonic. Oh, and speaking of Sonic, random fun fact. A few mil three moments ago, I was on YouTube and um, I was listening to some of my Sonic music and until I ran into this one video, well it's a Sonic hack video called Sonic 1 The Omachow Edition and I, I have to admit, that game is so fucking funny and, oh and it's a dick at the same time. Be able to climb up there. Because if A1 want to play um... If anyone want to play um, Sonic 1 the Omachow Edition, good fucking luck. Because that game is going to have you fucking raging. Alright, put the like on the video, so you guys want got, feel free to go on my profile and check it out. Ah, oh, shit. How the fuck we, how the fuck they knew we was going to be here? Fuck. We were being followed, wasn't we? You know what? I could sneak and kill them, but fuck that because last time I did that I got screwed over, so let's pop this fucker's head off. <laughs> Alright. So anyway, what the anyway, what the Oma Child Edition is about is they want you to go through the whole entire level without touching anything. 
Because if you touch a ring or kill an enemy, you hear Omachao say, You beat an enemy, you got a ring. Then you hear the freaking extra life theme playing in the background, but it plays multiple times depending on how many things you touched. But it can get really, really frustrating and annoying at the same time, but it's pretty funny though. So is someone going to do a let's play that game? Because I'm damn sure not. So. If you guys gonna ask me doing a let's play of uh, the Oma Child Edition, don't get y'all hopes up because that's not that's just not gonna happen. Even when you get to the boss fight, it gets worse. Yeah, it gets yeah, it gets worse when you fight Doctor Eggman because every time each time you hit Doctor Eggman, Oma Child will keep Oma Child will keep saying you attack the boss, you attack the boss. All right. Oh wait, a machine gun! Give me that machine gun! Shoot that mo- Oh, 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 whoa, 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 Don't- Don't get cocky, my friend. Or don't get too cocky, Star Fox. Alright. Glad I got that random fun fact out the way. Alright, it's more- It's more soldiers on the- uh, In the window. Hmm, I thought they were. Wait. I doubt I'll get that fucking trophy, but who cares, right? Alright. That's where you're supposed to go, though. Wait, I, I believe there's some more bad guys that we didn't kill yet. Oh, yep. Yep, yep, someone's here. I did hear the motherfucker say he's here somewhere. You lost me? Uh oh, I see you. I see you. Okay, now we can now we can go there. But you just fucking love it. They ain't gonna let you sequence break. Oh god. Oh god. Hit triangle. Oh, hello there. And, ooh, that's gotta hurt. I know who that in the morning. Oh! Get out of my face. Get that dick we out of my sight. Alright, here's a grenade. Now, what you wanna do? You wanna hold L1 and hit L2 to throw the grenade. Alright. Now we can go downstairs. <laughs> Even though there's no steps. Give me that machine gun. Oh wait, this oh yeah, this this part coming up next. See he's gonna automatically hop inside the uh he's gonna automatically take cover and you wanna hold L2, then release it to throw a grenade. Oh shit, see it's hard for me to see the okay. Okay, that should do the trick. All right. Of course you didn't. And once again, if Cutter was here, he would have a fucking heart attack. <laughs> and up the stairs we go. Okay, another shootout. And there goes Solly. All right, blind fire. Here we come. All systems full power. Like All right. Take you out. Oh shit. Oh you motherfucker. Oh you motherfuckers. Mm. How did you sneak up on me, man? I don't play that shit. Alright. I got him, Solly. Matter of fact, I got this one. Ooh, right in the fucking face. I ran out of machine guns. The SMG one. Uh oh. There you are. Damn, one shot kill. Oh, wait, 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 let's take cover. 
But that was a little awkward there. God damn it. Okay, I don't know which one to shoot. Oh my god. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Slice! Slice and dice! Oh, 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 oh! I think, I think if you do that a certain amount of times, you get a trophy. Oh, another random fun fact. My update on Boshi. Well, I managed to, uh, get BSL to help me beat Mega Man. And so, now I'm at the Mega Man world. You know, where I gotta fight Shang Tsung. So, don't worry, folks. And we'll be getting back to Boshi pretty shortly. Oh, and, uh, to the people... Two of the people who have me on on, uh, on PSN, if you guys are wondering what six days mean, why does my status say six days left? Well, it's because Grand Theft Auto 5 comes out in six days, and I cannot wait to I cannot wait to get it. I already got the game pre-ordered along with the guidebook, and I am really looking forward to I am really looking forward to play that game. I have seen the previews on that Monday when I was watching the Eagles game and that game looks very promising. Yes it does. It looks very promising. Alright. Let's open that door. Alright, now you wanna drop down. Not really sure. Oh shit! What a morals man. Talbot's yep, Talbot's man. That's impossible. They just got here. Yeah, but what could have happened? To Beats me. No idea, but I sure as hell don't like it. All right. Now we go down the ladder. Oh shit! The puzzle solving. What is an uncharted game without puzzle solving? All right. I I have the guidebook open right in front of me. So here's what you have to do. This doesn't say anything though. It's just nonsense. I'll stand over here. All right. Step on it by Good idea. Okay, so first thing you want to do, you want to walk a block, then turn left a block, then go up. Sit select. Well, I'm doing the strategy guys way there, but thanks. And you want to go right at least one time. Then go up three times, I believe. One, two, three. Oh, shit, I fucked up. You know what? I'm going to pull the book a little closer to me. Just an inch because I can't see far straight. Okay. That's one. Up one. Left one. Up one. Right one. Then it's up two. Alright. Left one. Down one. Left one. Up to and fuck you clicking sound and write three times one, two, three, up one, left one, and up one, and that's the puzzle. And sorry, and sorry, dude, I can't reply to you because I'm, I'm in the middle of recording. All right. Where we gotta go? Okay, in here. Wanna give us some light? Yeah, please, cause my laptop don't like the dark. Hey, a little more light, Sully. All right, I'm gonna let this one cutscene play, and then after that, that's the end of part five. Uh, I thought I was going to get this chapter done tonight, but we'll get it done tomorrow. Wait a second. Is this 
Does this place remind you of anything? Yeah. Marlowe's creepy hideout, not to mention it. Sully. Sully, this is John D's lab. John D. In France? Well, he must have traced the clues back to the Crusades, just like Lawrence did. Alright. Let's let this cutscene play. Then after that then I'll stop the video. But what are these symbols? Looks like he was trying to work something out. There's some sort of message written here in a knocking script. I'll try. Alright. Let's just select the use of cyber disk. Matter of fact, when I get to the next room, I'll stop the video. Entrance to the underworld. Well, he did use magic to conjure spirits. Yeah. Or the altar could be hiding a secret passage. Oh. Right. Help me push. All right, now you got to push the table. Oh wait, hit tap triangle, obviously. So I had to hold on to it. Look at that. Crafty old bastard. Alright. Where's the ladder part at? Right here. Okay. Let's climb down the ladder. Climb, 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 and bullet splash. Oh my goodness. Sorry about the dark screen, folks. Yeah, please. Now we can see. Much better. Is this the next chapter or is it? Let me go a little forward. Yeah, you know what, folks? This is where we're going. This is where we're going to start the video. So next time we're going to we're going to search for more stuff. Will we find T8 Lawrence's treasure? So we're going deep down in the underground in the next video. So until next time, Celtics 842 out and be sure to pray to your families because it's 12 years since 9/11 went down. Alright guys, for real. Alright guys, for real, I'm about to go offline, so peace out, folks.